Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Um, today I have a cage cleaning video for you guys. It's another PJ day as you can see. Um, why would I get dressed to clean up bunny cages? I don't know who would want to shower and everything before doing some poop cleaning. So uh, this is how I'm going to be looking like for this video. I'm going to be cleaning Laura's cage first and then Horizon's cage. Um, it is a little bit overdue. I should have cleaned their cages like a couple days ago so it's a little bit messier than normally. I don't let Alora out. I can't pick her up or anything. I have to get her spayed because she's getting aggressive. Um, so yeah, if you try to see me avoid her, that's why she gets aggressive with people. Um, I'm guessing getting her spayed will help with that problem. So we are looking into getting her spayed soon. So um, yeah, anyways, let's get started with this. Alright, so the first thing that I do is pull out the bunny litter boxes and I dump it out in a large trash bag. I wanted to show you guys that Alora's litter box is always this nasty because she digs up her litter and then she does her business under the litter right on the plastic. So that always sucks. And then I spray the entire litter box with a water vinegar solution. I will leave a link on how to make this down below in the description bar. And I will let that sit while I clean the rest of the cage. So Alora was being weirdly friendly in this little clip. But um, the next step is to take all of the toys and dishes and the tile, basically everything out of the cage. That way I just have the fleece left that I will then take out. I am going to be covering the base with a towel. Um, the base that they originally had was made out of cardboard and it got completely destroyed by their digging and their biting. And so I have to make a new base, but for now the towel will protect her feet from going through the bars. And finally, I am going to be putting this cute um, flowery fleece that I have had for the past year or so. It kind of reminds me of spring, so I figured I'd add some flowers to kind of encourage summer to come faster. I do clip the fleeces down in the corners with binder clips, um, that way it, pre it prevents her from digging it up and getting to the bars. I am now spraying a Laura ceramic tile with the water vinegar solution and wiping it off with a paper towel. I like to disinfect it every time that I cage clean because she does lay on it really often. Now it is time to clean the really bad litter box, so I basically just keep wiping it with paper towels and respraying it and rewiping it until it's cleaned and fully disinfected. As you can see at the end of this clip, there are going to be still some brown marks in it, it's just stained and she digs into the side of her litter box and it makes stuff get stuck inside of the scratches and stuff, but don't worry, it is 100% clean. Alright, so the litter that I use is actually cat litter. It's basically just recycled paper in this one. It's called Yesterday's News and I get it at PetSmart. It's fairly affordable compared to bedding made for rabbits. And then I just stick everything back into the cage, get some fresh toys, some fresh hay. I um, actually made a little toilet paper hay tube also. And as you can see, Alora actually is bad at chewing her litter box. So I have to actually get a new one soon. Alright, so my battery actually died. All that you guys didn't see is me cleaning out Alora's water bowl. All I did was gave it a good wipe with the water and vinegar and refilled it with fresh water and put it back in her cage. As you can see, she already made a mess out of her cage. Um, so I'm not going to do a cage tour. You guys can kind of see what she has. But again, it's already messy. And now it's time to start on Horizon's cage. Alright, so here I'm doing the exact same thing that I did with Alora's cage. The first thing I do is pull out Horizon's litter box. I dump it out in another trash bag and spray it with a water and vinegar solution. I actually, I actually took a quick break to cut Horizon's nails right here. That's why he looks a little bit stressed out and out because I literally just put him back in his cage. And now I'm going to take out the stuff and slowly roll up the fleece while putting the new towel up because, again, he also destroyed his cardboard base. I have to make him a new base too. Alright, so I picked this red, greenish, bluish fleece for Horizon's cage. I thought it was really cute, and again, I thought it kind of went with the spring theme, since spring is still coming up soon. Um, I do have to fold these fleeces at the edges a little bit because it's slightly too big, but it does fit the width of it perfectly. And I, again, have to clip his cage fleece because he will, again, dig it up just like Alora. Um, I'd rather him not dig it up and hurt his paws on the wiring and then I 
Um, again, I'm cleaning his tile just like I did with Alora, and I place new toys and stuff inside of his cage. I use the same litter that I used in Alora's cage in Horizon's cage. Um, make sure if you buy this litter that you get the unscented kind. Scented is kind of bad for the rabbits. And um, I also put the bunny bed back into his cage as his favorite bed, so I kind of tried to give it to him all winter. And since I'm not going to be doing laundry for a little while, um, I just shake it out real quick and I throw it back in. So I also got this cute clip of the cats. They love watching me clean. It's really weird. Pandora actually loves running through my dirt pile also. But a part of cleaning the bunny cages is also sweeping the messy floor in front of the cages. I actually have to do this pretty often because they make a mess. They keep throwing their hay outside the cages and stuff like that. And um, yeah, I just pick it up, throw it in the trash bag, tie it off, and then the trash goes outside um, after I'm done everything. Alright, thank you guys all for watching. I hope that you guys enjoyed. All I'm going to do is throw this trash back outside. And usually on days before I shower, I will go and shake out that entire basket up there. Um, that's all of the fleeces and stuff that are dirty. I just shake them outside and then throw them in the wash. And um, yeah, don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you enjoyed this video. New videos every single Tuesday. And um, yeah, I hope that you guys enjoyed. Here's a quick cage overview. And um, yeah, thank you guys again for watching.